first off, be wary of plague, therefore try frenzy. Be wary of blood loss, therefore all the more reason to try rump. How do you feel about that? You might say is NL sick? Yes. I told this story in chat already, but uh, my baby started to be sick maybe uh, Friday. Today is uh, is the following Thursday. I was actually doing very well. I felt no illness uh, whatsoever. And then I was holding her maybe on Tuesday. You know, and when you hold, I just got my mouth open. I'm just relaxing. Babies don't go like, ah, 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 a chew. They just go, tch, and like, do that. I felt droplets of, of baby sneeze. Like, it hit the back of my throat. And I was like, I know I'm, I'm done. I'm toasted. So I'm, I'm pretty sure that that's what happened. It's pretty wild, though. Yesterday, I was like, I'm definitely starting to feel sick, but not only did I Peloton, I PB'd. And then uh, today, I was like, there's no chance I'm getting on that bike. Are you crazy? Phew! Okay, what? what, 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 what? So there is, a, apparently, there is a... Uh, this path that I got tilted and baited on yesterday, there is a boss at the end of it. I've been told... There's a monster at the end of this book. By the way, as long as we're talking about oh, goaded Sesame Street jams, any Sesame Street fans in the chat? Anybody uh, listen to The Monster in the Mirror by uh, by Grover? I'll say a wabba 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 and a woo woo woo. Wabba 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 and a doodly doo. Wabba, 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 and I sing this song. You know that one? Because wabba, wabba, wabba is a monster song. It's a great one, man. Miguel77. Thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Thank you. This is just looping me back, man. I've been here. Lupe still like looping the third. I think every song with mirror in the title is a slapper. You haven't. Okay, never mind, never mind. Like, uh, Monster in the Mirror by Grover. Man in the Mirror by Michael Jackson. Uh, it's like Looking in the Mirror by uh, Justin Timberlake. I don't know the name of the song. Commoner's headband altered? Hold on. Now you got me thinking. You know what? I was digging the cloak, but there's something about this. <laughs> there's something about this that... It's got me feeling a certain sort of way. Nice try. Nice try. Why is it always lovers therefore try explosion? Another great message. Honestly, I, I hate to keep repeating this, but I do think that if you wanted to get a lot of easy upvotes in this game, I've been thinking about it for a while. A manor tower shield, how about that? I've been I've been workshopping the uh, the best messages you can make in Souls, and I think I found it. Surely what you seek is somewhere close by. And it's gross. I want to tell you in advance that it's gross. Um, but here's the message. Be wary of blood, therefore try rump. Look carefully. So true. Look carefully. One, I'm looking carefully. I'm not good at this, like, escape room stuff. Here's the thing. I'm not good at escape room stuff when it's like you have to solve uh, an abstract puzzle. But when they're like, oh, I'm pretty sure you have to do uh, arithmetic. I'm like, I already did that shit. It's 62. Then they go, boop, 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 six, zero, zero, six, two, boop, boop, boop. And then the shit just pops open and there's like a little key in there. I'm great at that. I don't think I want to go down one more level. 
I don't think blood is in the game. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Let's let's workshop it. This is disgusting, but I'm going to make it anyway, okay? Message was appraised. Be wary of... We, be wary of blood loss. Therefore, try rump. That one is, is workable for sure. Hey, Lelling too? Thank you. Thank you for the... Or try tail. I don't know. They're both good. Thank you for the gifted subscriptions. Oh! First off, well done. You know what? You got me. Fair enough. Uh, how many how many souls I got? Seventeen hundred. Guess we could just teleport back to this bonfire. The lift side chamber. The rampart tower. I think I was probably in the lift side chamber. That sounds right. Just keep going? Keep going down? Oh, the <laughs> I'm actually dumb, man. I'm actually stupid. Ranged battle. Wait, but isn't this where we entered the, the castle? Nope. Safety. Don't lie to me. Rainbow stone. Behold, shortcut. Well... YouTube would have been real mad at that one. It's you know what? You're not wrong. I've got to acknowledge, uh, you know, there's there's pluses and minuses to playing the game on uh, on YouTube versus Twitch. On YouTube, I get forty minutes of not no backseating, just living in my own meditative world. Um, but then I get my ass ate in the in the quote retweets. Can you believe? He was looking right at the lever, but he could not find the lever. So I think I take the good with the bad, you know? Yeah, you know, like that, that Mickey Mouse image that's like, they eating your ass in the, in the QRTs. You know what I'm talking about. Hello. Why is it always bats? Go ahead. Ooh, tough luck. You stink. You stink. An arterial leaf. How about that? Good. Uh, you know what? It's a great opportunity to leave a message that just says dog. You're not wrong. I'm going to abstain. I've already left a message that says be wary of blood loss. Therefore, try rump. Hello, bats. You guys aren't doing so well, huh? Take one of these, then. Take one of... No! Oh! So, I I was talking with Apollo last night. Apollo is basically, like, beating the game, right? And I, I think he's made an effort to not only beat the game, but pretty much, like, you know, get close to 100%ing it. Which I could totally understand having that ambition if uh, your last month on Twitch has just been playing Lost Ark. So, I, I respect where he's coming from with that. I was talking to him about uh, about Elden Ring, and he says, hey, just so you know, like, I also tried to just go beast mode strength, but there's a soft cap at, like, 40 or 50, at which point you may want to start putting some points into other stuff. Ooh. So I think I've come to terms with that. I'm insane. Uh... Soft cap is 60, is 51 or so. Okay. Okay. Either way, I do think I've got to put some stats into other things. Uh, and I think HP is probably the, the best. <laughs> I think we could use a little bit of HP so we can actually take advantage of our of our flasks. We go down here, right? Like this I'm or stam. Yeah. I, I definitely agree. Please prioritize, prioritize meathead build. Well, this is a meathead build, don't get me wrong. But I think we're going to need a... You start with a pretty good amount of stam. But I think we're going to need um, a little bit of, of vitality for sure. Just because, like, we're already kind of at the point... I forgot how to jump. Never mind, I'm the best. Uh... We're already at the point, like, even the bosses we're facing right now, some of their attacks just one-tap us. So, 
I think we're going to have to make an effort to, to maybe be able to up our resiliency a little bit. Be honest with me. Can you square up with this thing? If, if, I, if I go to the bonfire, I mean, sorry, the, the Shrine of Grace, totally different. Um, can I put square up on this? No, you can't. Well, maybe Elden Ring too. Nice try. Rats, come on. Come on. I don't think so. Give me my flask back. Hey, Anel, my pants just split. How are the Lululemons? Uh, so I got them two months ago. They're still holding up strong. N haven't even been close to a tear. Haven't even felt any, any stress on the seams. The one thing I will say, and, and it comes up every time I talk about them, they are not cheap pants, okay? So I think there's, there's two paths you can take, and it's up to you. Alright, that was great. There's two different kinds of, of man you can be, and you can, you can go back and forth between them, okay? One is, I'm gonna buy six pairs of jeans for, I don't know, $50 total at Winners. And then as they blow out, I'm just going to replace them. And that's okay, because they were so cheap. And then the other one is, I'm going to embrace paying a little bit more for the pants, but the pants are going to last forever, or a longer period at least. Now, I'm not suggesting that it'll pay for itself, okay? Because I don't think that's the case. The heck? This is a boss arena for sure. There's there's a large hairy dog in here without a doubt. I think if you're going for price per wear, you're probably going to do better buying jeans at winners. Straight up. Praise the message. Okay, how about I disparage the message? Beggars can't be choosers. But I will also say... You appraised it? Oh, whoops. Everybody gets one. I will also say um, they're very comfortable. So maybe maybe you could factor in like another 25 cents per wear just for the comfort premium. How are you going to get lost on a straight path? I guess we just drop down. Let's do it, man. God, I wish that were me. Probably not going to open the casino just yet. Okay. Um. <laughs> Yeah, um, we might leave this one for a minute. I think we'll move past the, uh, the Godric threshold here that we just unlocked. What an interesting dog. Back to Dragon Arm Boy? Oh, who's gonna tell him? Who's gonna tell him? Nice dog. Apollo, Apollo, have you been here for a while? Can I show you the best message in, in Souls that I invented? I invented it. Be wary of blood loss. Therefore, try rump. If you press R1, you can see how your messages do. Okay, okay, hold on. First off, pathetic sort, all the more demi-human ahead. That was when I insulted chat. This was directed towards you, chat. Likely horse. This one pisses me off, man. Because this was a great message. This was at that turtle that was like 30 stories tall. Likely horse. That's a great message. Zero upvotes. First off, rump. Therefore, be wary of blood loss. That's a great message. Zero Try rump, but be wary of taking on all at once. When we saw that big, uh, that big, I don't even know what you call it. It was like a cairn in the dungeon. First off, try rump, but be wary of taking on all at once. 
Be wary of taking on all at once. Likely dog. I'm getting blown out, man. They eating my ass in the QRTs. They are all variations on the same thing. I'm getting uh, I'm getting annoyed, man. You know what? I gotta I gotta start doing. Uh... Oh, I don't want to be here. What am I doing? Take take me to take me back to Godric. Um. Who is at the secluded cell? Maybe I gotta start leaving like uh, beta messages. I gotta start leaving messages that are like, "Ooh, message." Therefore, praise the message. Shit makes me sick. Disgusting. Oh, hello. You're just chilling. I got no quarrel with you. Yeah, yeah, get his ass. <laughs> Craven to the <laughs> He's owning him. Let's go. I mean, I did all the work, just so you know. Like, wait, he beat him? It was, is this even a boss? He was like 30 feet tall at a minimum. Thanks to you. I tell you though, what goes around comes around. He had an ugly heart, an uglier countenance, and met the ugliest of ends, eh? Thanks for your help during the fight, by the way. I really appreciate it. Now I can, can I? Sure, yeah, do whatever. Now okay, do whatever you want. I'm not going to kill him. He hates Godric. I hate Godric. We don't make a lot of friends in these games, man. I'm like, honestly, this is like the first Dark Souls NPC I've ever related to. Why do you hate Godric, though? He was kind of like pissing me off with his five-hit combo. It is a sad story, right? He's like, I'm free. I can do whatever I want. And he's like, well, you know what? It's a living. Stomp, stomp. Let's see what let's see what the messages say. Behold, old codger, not good enough. Now, Don't talk to me. You don't have the right. Disparaged. You know what? I think we could do some numbers here. It's gonna take me so long to beat this game. Try. Stomping. Try. <laughs> I don't know. Whatever. Who cares? Who cares? I don't like this. I, maybe I will hammer him. You know what? You think you're funnier than me? I'm not going to say try pickle. I'm better than that. Champion. Well done, praise the Elden Ring. Well done, warrior. Nerds. Nerd messages have been found. Ooh! Try brief respite. Try crouching. How you sit on a chair when you're eight years old. That's it? Oh, no, there's another door. Oh, thank God. You got here on the first day? Wait a minute. Is this the same place? I thought this was, uh... I thought there were multiple chairs. They were like, uh, the, the Bifrost from... Thor? Oh, wait, is this the... I don't know. I have no idea where we are, just to be honest with you. Wicked sort ahead. Oh, okay, not... No secret passage ahead, but praise the message. I will not. You got a berry here? I guess I'll go down. Oh, I remember.
remember. Yeah, I walked around this whole castle the first time by accident. Then I came out here. There's a lot of wolves and dogs and stuff. Behold, Rump. So true. So true. Absolutely true. You know what? That's damn true. Okay, so you can like, you know what? Let, let's try for a second. I did, I, I got the Lord's Incredible Soul. What does one do with this thing? It's devoid of any benediction, so it's useless. Seek the Divine Tower of Limgrave, which stands beyond the Great Bridge from Stormvale Castle. It's that thing right there. Yeah, 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 it's that thing right... Okay, okay, okay. I see ya, I see ya, but first... That's not it. Mm -hmm. Haters are everywhere. First off, check this out. Nobody does it better. Carly Simon. Lyernia of the, the Church of Erith. We've been here. Okay, hold on. Next step. Gotta be very careful. Snakes are everywhere these, these days. <clears throat> it's across the really long bridge. The one that the hater told me I couldn't get across. You are never going to beat this game. You will never get this. You will never get this. And then you know what happened. If you've seen, if you've seen the movie, one day he got this. We okay up here? No problem. A warming stone? Sure. You're just a guy. Like, you're, you're nothing. A couple little skulls. See if I give a shit. You got, you got a problem? Apollo, just because you did everything in this game, you think you know everything. But you know what? Everybody has got a different experience. If you want to make the world a better place, take a look at yourself and then make a change... We were talking about Man in the Mirror by Michael Jackson earlier. You're a little strong, huh? Okay, give me your loot. You know you got loot. Take a look at my girlfriend. So true. Oh no, he comes back. Right, that makes sense. Um, quick, quick question. What's the best Super Tramp song? I'm gonna say that the best Super Tramp song is... I mean, it's close. There's a lot of classics. I'm a Goodbye Stranger Man, personally. Logical Song is good. Um, Breakfast in America is good. Way to go, dummy. You're dead. I want Goodbye Stranger played at my funeral. Who are you, Toby from The Office? Didn't expect a lover? Bliss, oh bliss. This game is just filled with nerds. Case in point. Watch this. Would a nerd do that? I want Goodbye Horses played at my funeral. No joke, Goodbye Horses is, is a bop and a half. It's one of those double-edged swords, right? Where, like, it's such a good song, but it's like, you can't unlink it from Buffalo Bill in Silence of the Lambs. So it probably is responsible for like almost all of its popularity, but also for the fact that it's slightly underrated as a result. It is synonymous with the tuck. There's no doubt about that. Question mark? Have you seen Silence of the Lambs? If you haven't seen Silence of the Lambs, you'd be confused. But there's a scene in the movie where one of the bad guys uh, goes, Would you fuck me? 
I'd fuck me. I'd fuck me hard. And then goes burp, 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 burp. Goodbye, horses. And he's dancing around. Um, he's he's obscured. He's obfuscated his uh, genitals by placing. Well, you know what he did. First off, try a disguise. Therefore, attempt rump. Kind of. Why are you talking about Silence of the Lambs? It's one of the most... Uh, it's, it's a good movie. That's why I'm talking about Silence of the Lambs. I've been here. This is how I got here in the first place. Silence of the Lambs is... That movie is legit. I will die. I will die if I fall here. On the other hand... On the other hand... Uh, oh yeah, sure, Silence of the Lambs is good. I mean, it's no drive my car, but... I'll live here. There's, there are three bloodstains down there, but you know what? It's because they didn't use their horse, probably. I lived, bitch. Mm. <laughs> Goodbye, horses. True, true. That's true. That's pretty true. Okay, hold on. I've I've gotten some hot tips from the from the chat. One of the tips was now that you've got that rune, what about talking to the guy who was like, "You'll never have any maidens. You're just like a piece." That's a good point. We should go talk to that guy again now that we got the now that we got the rune. Oh well done. You best yep. my Yep. This now visit the round table hold for an audience with the two fingers in the inner chamber. Um You kiss your mother with that mouth? That's true. That's true. That's true. Hold on. I remember. I got his... It's not you. I don't really care for you. It's you. Yeah, but he, he was in here. But now he doesn't want to speak to me? Who the heck are you? Oh, hello. I've not seen you here before. I'm the, good, likewise. I'm the Feli Lu warrior. You're in the wrong game. You think this is lineage too? He's in his study. The room enters garden just over there. If you haven't already, Father is leader of the round table. Okay. I'm sure talking to him. Yeah, I mean, I've probably spoken to him, I don't know, about a thousand times. Can I introduce myself, please? It's about time I I'll see you again. Okay, cool. Yeah, sure. Don't speak to me. I don't, I don't respect you. There's a big central door by the table. Yeah. Yeah, this one. I wouldn't dare. This is where you fight the asylum demon? Yeah, this way. This way. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. This way? There's finally the door is open to me. Hello, I've seen you in the trailer. I'm bigger than you. I'm higher on the food chain. Get in my belly. Oh, look there. The fingers tremble to welcome you, Shardbear. Let the wash over you, great Elden Ring. Root of the Golden Order. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Regional vice president in charge of marketing. Of I get it. Until it was shattered. 
You know what I don't respect about Elden Ring? They took away your agency during cutscenes, so I can't just mash L1 when I'm sick of hearing what she's talking about and go tuk, 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 and just block like endlessly in front of her face. I miss that. But the great will you can? Not abandoned a realm, nor the life that inhabits it. So you can, but not in this area. So you can't. Called to act in the round table. Your great room is a handsome shard of the Correct. Okay. Seek another. Hope you guys have been paying attention to this. I have not. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Sure, I'll uh, receive power from Remembrance. You can draw out the power of Remembrance's namesake. Each Remembrance can provide... Okay, so these are boss souls. I understand. We could get the Axe of Godric. I command thee, Neil. Grafted Dragon. A Fist Weapon. Bear Witness. You can also dupe them at the Big Dog. I'm not sweating it. I'm not sweating it. 22 decks, I'm kind of sweating then. I, we don't need it right now. We can, we can get it at a later date. Okay, great runes, great runes. Blah, 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 Remember one thing. Queen Marika. What about Queen Melania, though? Can we speak? What if I attack you? Touch the two fingers. Rapture! The axe is goaded? Well... What's your deal again? Would you like to learn an incantation? No, not really. What the heck is rejection? Produces a shockwave that pushes away foes. I.e. most annoying PvP spell? I'll, I'll study some incantations. Like, for example, like I could um, get a litany of proper death and create images of order to deal holy damage. I haven't met Lania! Oh my god, why are you so obsessed with her? It's so weird. Get a hobby. Yeah, exactly. Okay, can you... I don't have enough runes to strengthen my brick hammer. I spoke with Luke. She has it, so I told her. I'm indebted. It was all work. I'm sorry. I... He said, I'm sorry I doubted you. Can you believe me? Okay, hold on. We're, we're about to get content started. How, how the heck did I get 17? I guess I did rob a lot of graves. That's fair. Back already, no matter. I would like to strengthen my armament. I'm rolling this for a minute, man. Why not? We just... Dude, this thing is gonna pop. Are you kidding me? Holy cow. I'll use like four of these bad boys. This thing is gonna go thermonuclear. Okay, we're, we're tapped there. I feel like we doubled its damage now. And then if you talk to that lady, she'll sell you stuff. Oh, thank you, thank you. It's great intel. Where did the lady go, though? Oh, the door is open. What the heck? You've received the yes, I have. I bid you welcome. I'm known as Gideon. That's me. I belong to a select group of fellows. Uh oh. The volcano manor of Mount Gelmir. Hey, just tell me about the loathsome dung eater, okay? 
What happened to the loathsome dung eater? Whenever the loathsome dung eater is not on the screen, every viewer should be asking, what's the loathsome dung eater doing? I don't need to speak to you right now. Okay, well. Any lore masters in the round table hold? Apparently, I've been told if you rest at the round table. Can I, can I rest here? You don't talk to me, dude from Hades. Is a grace? Okay, and then she's just chilling now. She's just chilling now. I might have to travel out, then travel in. Unless I'm blind. It's been known to happen. She's near the smith now. At least I'm playing this on the PS5. Where, uh, the load times are so fast. I've heard they are three times faster than the Xbox Series X. PS5. I, I'm a, a mod at RPS5. I'm really trying to achieve my goal of being elevated to administrator. What's your problem? Oh my god, about prayer. Alright, it's, it's no sweat or whatever. Literally walked right past her. Oh, I wasn't looking for her. I'm just going to go ahead and say it. This is not going to get me... Uh, it's not going to get me a lot of great comments on YouTube. Roundtable hold. Worst area in the whole game. There's nothing of value here. It's just lore. There's not even a single boss. Take me to the south and don't stop till you're numb. I'll go south of the lookout tower. We got some exploring to do. This is not a place of honor. Nice trolling. Thank you. Thank you. I thought so too. Okay, we want to go south. Now, I think we'll probably kill every boss in one hit. I mean, every enemy in one hit. I don't know about the bosses yet. Why is it always dog? Oh, I'm so scared. Good start. The mosquito can follow me as far as I care. I definitely have a hard time um, remembering where I am and what I've done in this game. <laughs> Anybody else in the same boat there? Or just me? Same? This MF sick again, joy emoji. We're in the middle of uh, a, a global pandemic. You're making fun of me for having a, an illness? Bad look. Bad look. That's all I'm going to say about that. Note, demi-human mobs. Crimson Amber Medallion, not interested. See you never. Imagine getting sick. It's okay, I know you're not going to get as sick as I do, because I go out and hang out with, like, cool people all the time who are on, like, worldwide tours, and you guys only have one possible vector for infection, which is your DoorDash driver. It's okay, like, you know, green's not your color, okay? You hear that? Napoleon, you're just jealous because I've been chatting with hot babes online all day. Ortis Rise. But I heard someone, like, weeping over here. That might be my own baby <laughs> in real life. <laughs> you did hear something. Something, something did print, yeah. yeah. Oh, I remember this. I spent about 20 minutes here. That's right.
Do you know how to find maps yet? I was just thinking, like, maybe if, like, another 100,000 people, um, posted, uh, how to do it in the chat every, like, 10 seconds, maybe I could figure it out. Hello? I hear you around here. What are you, what are you doing over here? Would you do it then? No, I'm marching to the beat of my own drum. People in chat will legit be like, Oh, mom, don't tell me to clean my room. I'm 17, I'm my own man. Then they jump onto Twitch chat and they're like, Hey, do exactly this right now. You, you should know what it's like. Honestly, give me one of these. Give me one of these. All right, I don't know how to open it then. You hear that? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Seek three wise beasts. Three wise beasts? What's wiser than a turtle? I ask you. I ask you this. You mean a dog? Yeah, but why is it always dog? You don't have the right. You don't have the right. You don't have the right. Thank you. Okay, like you're you're a wise beast. There's no doubt about that. I would never attack you. You have done nothing wrong. My quarrel is not with you. What about this thing? What about this satellite dish up here? Okay, you started it. You looked at me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Flask? No Diet Coke flask, please. We, we need the real thing. We need Coca-Cola Classic. Stop staggering me! You have to attack it. I will do it to progress. Because progression is my number one virtue in life. But I would prefer not to. You're still alive. Holy cow. Alright. I mean, if you're baiting me and we don't have to do this... Whatever. He didn't have a health bar. He's probably okay. Seek three wise beasts. They're ghosts! It, killing a ghost is not even murder. It's just called busting. It's two different things. And it's actually based. And it makes me feel good. Ray Parker Jr. was onto something. Starlight Shards. Has any song lyric ever been truer than... Busting makes me feel good. Probably the most non-fiction song ever written, which is pretty funny because it's called Ghostbusters. Three wise beasts. Think they ever busted some ghosts? I do seem to recall that Dan Aykroyd received uh, a busting at the hands of a ghost. He did not bust the ghost. The ghost busted him. Bust a nut. True? That's pretty true. I would... I'm seeking three ghost turtles. What the heck is this? I don't know if I want to be here. Hello. That's good. That's good news. Alright, I'm fighting a large, um... Kinda looks like me, to be honest. Dada? This is where I saw Apollo on the first day. Oh my God. That's a scary thought for me. But I'm definitely stronger than Apollo was when he was at this point. <laughs> I love that face, oh my god. Oh, snip snip, I want to cut it off. Snip snip, that's like what it looks Snarf. like. Snarf! The face looks like... <laughs> okay. Okay. Don't look babby. I will say, I, it was so easy to be the bigger man when I was not sick. 
now that I got sick, I, I recant what I said earlier, where I was like, um, you know what? I don't feel like I have any malice in my heart for the mom who knowingly dropped her daughter off at daycare when she was ill. Everybody's in here like, you know, they're trying their best. It's a hard time. Now that I'm sick, I'm like, she just made the list. I'm just, I, I've been rehearsing like what I'm going to say in my head. The last word she said to me on Thursday when I picked my daughter up was, Sorry if I got you guys all sick. Then I'm looking at the photos we're getting sent from daycare this week, and it's literally like every kid is in daycare except for our kid. I've just been rehearsing what I'm going to say in my head, man. I don't know what it is yet. Oh, I gotta read the book again. Thank you, thank you. Like, I'm... Easy one, easy thing to do? No problem. Yeah, it's no problem. You know, we're all doing our best. But in my head, I'm like... You know... Yeah, it fucked up our week pretty bad. You know, but at least it's only the seventh time uh, since November. So don't sweat it. Turtle. Do you see a, there was a there was movement in the water? Are you there's a there's something here. Or was that just me? I knew it! Don't even give me this. Oh no, it's the Sekiro. The the painting guardians again. I'll get you. Let's go! Funny monkey. Look at the monkey. But for what purpose? Oh, a ladder. Behold, ladder? You know what would be a nice upgrade to get in this game? What about like a... Like a, a little drone that you could pilot? That would allow you to fly up and ignore the topography. A memory stone. Let me guess. Something to do with magic. Fantastic. Look, I'm great at Elden Ring when it comes to the bosses. I'm just not very good at Elden Ring when it comes to the navigation. But the game is not called who can find their way the fastest. The game is called who can be the strongest. So that's... Oh, I gotta go the other way. It's actually called Elden Ring. Mm. Snakes uh, technically don't have parts, but if they did, I think this would be his knee. I lived. All right, so real talk. What are we doing next? Do we go to Kalim next? Whatever it's called. Karim. Do we start gaming? It's called Khalid? I thought that was a rapper. Just keep exploring. All right, if you, if you tell me to just keep exploring, I'm content to do that. Finish this area. Okay. This looks promising. A large building? That's promising. Now what the heck is this thing? It's like looking in the mirror. Oh, whoa. Is this a seed? Map of Weeping Peninsula. Whoa! Here I am at the Weeping Peninsula. Nice try. I'm 
Sends Fortress. Okay. Obviously, you should not fight this guy. But obviously, we gotta try. Watch this. You ready? Ready for this? Uh, actually, he's the weakest enemy that's ever existed. And he gives you a thousand runes. Are you okay? Are you in trouble? Behold, easy foe. Honestly, I could use an area to just go, you know, brain empty R2 mode. Maybe this is that moment. Try pickle. This is that area. Let's go. Let's go. This castle is not it. I think it depends when you do things, right? I think I might be doing this a little bit later. Like, you know, everybody does Elden Ring at their own pace. Like, Dan is on hour 20, and he's still farti uh, farting. <laughs> he's still fighting partially hydrogenated vegetable oil. I'm on hour 3, and I've already beaten half the bosses in the game. So I'm not, like, too concerned about anything. I'm just here at Castle Morn. Dan's in the weeds right now. I saw him fight Margit. He's going to beat Margit today, without a doubt. And that's not Copium. Like, he actually has the tools. When I was watching him fight Margit, I was like, this reminds me of someone I know. It reminds me of myself when I was younger. You hear that? Stop calling it that. Is Margit? Margita Apple Bomb, you gotta put me on. Isn't Dan ten years older than you? I think Dan's like five years older than me. Um, but I was younger than I am now when I beat that boss. So that's why it reminds me of me when I was younger. Hello. Any enemy with wings in this game is on site. Man, oh man. I would love to have done, like, two extra damage to you there. See ya! <laughs> Half-Life? Anybody? Any PC gamers in the chat? Anybody ever played Half-Life? This reminds me so much of Half-Life. Did I ever tell you that was when I stopped playing Half-Life? I opened up the portal accidentally to let the Zen uh, breach the walls. And then you go down that elevator like 15 minutes later and all the headcrabs jump after you. Okay, fair enough. I didn't, didn't think that would get me. Uh, and I just turned the game off. I was like, it's too scary. You freaking double staller. You double staller. I was really afraid of, like, aliens when I was a kid. I would say from age, like... Probably from the first time I saw Independence Day, as, as a youngster, maybe I was like eight. Until I was like 11. Aliens were my big fear. Holy cow. Fire grease. No thank you. Oh, acquire materials? A smoldering butterfly, of course. Of course. No, peace. That was scary for me as a kid. I mean, I, there were, I'll, I'll tell you, it was only movies, right? Things that scared me uh, in alien movies when I was a child. There's so many. No peace from Independence Day was a big one. Uh... Much of Mars attacks at the end of Lost in Space when uh, 
Dr. Smith or whatever his name was, played by Gary Oldman, turns into a fucking, like, weird spider. That scared the shit out of me as a kid. And that movie is not good enough to cause nightmares. So to, like, be a child and be traumatized by that shitty movie is like, I'm dead. I'm alive. Is not, I wouldn't say embarrassing, it's more just like, your movie shouldn't be that scary if it's that ass. Try backstepping. Uh, signs, many moments in signs. The the alien walking across at the birthday party is definitely like the worst. Um, I might just hang out here for a minute. Hey, what the hell, man? I was trying to help. Uh, also, when they shove the knife under the door to see if there's an alien there, and you see the alien's hand, it's a bit of a scary moment. Oh, that's bullshit. You know it. You can't do that. You know what? I deserve to catch a stray there. It is funny to think back that they did, uh... The hell? Where am I? That they did catch uh, an alien in their closet. They were like, we caught one in the closet. And it was just going like, hello? Hello? Let me out. Hello? Hello? Tick, 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 tick. Hello? I'm not using a, a plus zero... Claymore, okay? We have we have a plus six brick hammer right now. Look at this thing. It's just a cinder block attached to a pretzel rod. I love it. It's the state weapon of Pennsylvania. Oh, I can hear the baby going hello out there. Hello? Um, hello? I called you this morning? This morning. Oh, my dear. Oh, Medea, what kind of crazy hijinks will you get up to next? Yahoo? I had nightmares from the X-Files. Yeah, I couldn't watch that shit as a kid. I legit was like... I was kind of a scared kid. Ever tell you about... I, I know I have, but maybe... Okay, fair enough. There we go. By minus 5,000 souls. Um, ever tell you about the time that uh, in, like, 1997, the fire alarm went off at our school? I was in third grade, and the Oklahoma City bombing had just happened. And I was convinced, like, someone was trying to blow up our uh, our school. So when they evacuated during the fire drill, I was just, like, in tears. My teacher was consoling me. And I was like, well, what if someone's trying to blow up the school? My teacher was like, nobody's trying to blow up the school. Come on. We live in the middle of nowhere. I'm not saying it couldn't happen, but it's implausible. And then it turned out that it was just, like, uh, like somebody left a hairdryer plugged in in the bathroom too long or something like that. I need more backstabs, please. Okay, be methodical. You know how it works. Be methodical. Try jumping. This is this is your natural regression before progression. It happens all the time. You stink. You're amazing. You're unbelievable. These guys are pretty strong. Man. This is not like a walk in the park, like a beach house song. Track two off of their album Team Dream. You baited me! You, I didn't know you had a little henchman! It's like track eight. What's track two? Oh, you're right. Track two is Norway. That's my bad. 
track one is like, you know, you go in a voracious child, son of my own mind. Don't I know you better than the. I know, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. And there it goes. Bum, 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 bum. Great song. Great album, man. Great album? Why do you make every song sound like it's by Bruce Springsteen? It, it's, you've forgotten. I, my Bruce Springsteen songs do not sound like they're by Bruce, Brings, Bruce Springsteen. Br Bruce Springsteen. This is... This <laughs> sounds like a... Like the last words of a dying octogenarian. Oh, run away, American dream. At night we ride through mansions of glory on suicide machines. Hello, Peter Pumpkinhead. Hey, lick my hadron. Thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. And Sanctuary Stone. Great beach house song. What if I just sneak? Bob Dylan cover? Well, that's more nasal. I don't know if I can do a Bob Dylan when I'm sick, but it's, you know. Wouldn't that feel so all alone? I require more smithing stones. It's something like that. Immediate glances for plus two, minus two distribution. That's so sad. You're actually, you were literally just sitting there and you got ambushed by the loudest motherfuckers in the game. How does that happen? I think that's more plus twos than minuses. Do not glance. Do not glance. Yeah, okay, I'll just gesture real quick. Five bolts, fantastic. Good point, good point. Okay, I've learned my lesson. You know, this doesn't concern me. This is between the, the weird birds and the king's guard, and then all we gotta do is kind of hang out and get the scraps. I miss the 08 to 2012 era of dream pop. You, I don't care, you can call me a boomer if you want. Yeah, I mean, like, if we're talking dream pop, I mean, the pinnacle of the genre has to be Teenage Dream by Katy Perry, for sure. It's got to be probably, like, the most eminent example of the genre. Guess what? <laughs> Fuck you, that's what. I, re I really can't think of the song without singing, you know, you make me feel like I'm living a teenage dream the way you suck me off. It, it just, it just feels like that's the words in my head. How is it possible that I can kill all of these enemies in one hit? They can kill me in two hits, but it takes them 20 hits to kill each other. Like, what is going on with this? Doesn't make any damn sense. You have less vitality than them? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's probably true, huh? Ooh! You got caught sleeping! You got caught looting, son! I miss 2005 indie rock. You mean indie rock that's like, cause nobody knows you and nobody gives a damn either. That? You know what I'm, cat jam, rat jam, chip dance. Cat jam, rat jam, chip dance. You just jump off here, of course. Of course. Ooh, yo. 
almost got me. Just kidding. Get owned? That is a Red Hot Chili Peppers song. But I'm only singing it ironically, so you can't get mad at me. I just got a shot at. None of these bats are wielding a crossbow. I'm trying to purge your castle of bats. You're going to have the audacity to shoot a bolt at me? Or is that a kukri? Maybe, maybe it was the bat. Maybe the bat is a hater. I mean, dog. What genre would you describe Nickelback as? Um, like Monster Energy rock and roll? Cliff ahead and then Seek Grace? Uh, Sends Fortress? Let's go! Okay, this is perfect timing. You can see me squirming around in my chair. I gotta go to the bathroom real bad. I'm not even gonna run ads.